so much left. I finally bagged up today. Woo! Got a really quick um Dragon Ball video. I want to do the really quick, of course. Hopefully, I won't like spend too long on this. But that's pretty good news right here. Sorry, I'm recording this really late. If my recordings cut out, like and stuff like that, they crash and cut out. Um, don't worry about it. I'll just get right back to the video because for some odd reason, the recorder I'm using right now is recording stuff like that for videos. Um, and that's not that. It's the computer. My computer's being really weird right now, so I'm gonna try to fix that in the next couple days. Cause you guys can tell I have like full video. There'll be no cutouts. Um, my other videos have like a lot of cutouts. You'll see. You know, yeah, the recorder crashes a lot. Um, then like, there are options like someone's calling me and stuff like that, and I edit that out of the video. You can definitely tell. Um, I'm like a bright or come back like a completely different time. You'll definitely know why. The grind's pretty late, so I don't have to have the big, you know, that, um, carpet, not carpet, on my like blanket in the background, so you know, keep the lighting and stuff like that. I do have a fan right here, so hopefully it'll be okay for you guys. But yeah, Ella Frieza is finally getting his EZA for global for JP. <laughs> yeah, he's getting his EZA for global. Um, but yeah, getting his EZA for JP. Um, pretty awesome though, honestly. I'm I'm kind of glad he's gonna get EZA. Yeah, at the same time, in my opinion, he didn't really need it. But there's other stuff I want to talk about in this video as well, which I'm glad. Okay, I'm back though. Uh, my thing again, like I said, a lot of cuts out and stuff like that. But yeah, like I said before, um, I think I didn't go over it fully. Um, like I said, Lord Frieza, I was thinking he didn't really need EZA because he was already pretty good beforehand. But yeah, um, again, you know, aging and stuff like that, difference. However you want to pronounce it, however you want to go through it and stuff like that. Um, these units are the only units you can use against his EZA. Um, it's like Elder Goku's would basically need a set amount of units and stuff like that. They all have to be very much in 100% like the last one. Again, I have never released that um, Elder Goku video, by the way. Um, for his, um, you know, EZA and stuff like that. I never really released it. I don't know why. But yeah. Um, again though, we should see, um, here's the EZA, probably the next upcoming week. Oh, here we go, Deco. What's up? Check my dog down here. But yeah, um, for Gohan and stuff like that, the first four different, the first three should be really easy. The Gohan, in the middle from the name of the story event, it gets all the story events will come back, so then it goes to Piccolo. You can miss 100% of them for free. I know Goku's the EZA, the Kai can go Goku from the Lord's Slug event. He's the EZA. Um, Bardock, I definitely know, um, that uh, Bardock right there, he's the AGA one that goes to Great Ape. He will be, um, a new awakening and stuff like that, he'll have his own easy area. And that's a Bobby Shop Krillin right there, the STR one, the Krillin at the end. Gillow woke up and I saw this this morning, and I was like, holy crap, Gillow's getting awakening. That's nice. Um, but yeah, um, really good stuff though, honestly. I was like, holy crap, this is nice. I like it, it's really good. Um, of course, I want to go through it. His might be a little bit more fault. It was just me trying to do all that. Okay. All right, guys, I'm back. Um, sorry about that. My, um, I just had to fix up a couple of things. Like I said, these are all the new units. The one, the very criminal at the end, he is a barber shop unit. You can get him completely for free in the barber shop. Piccolo, he is from like a story event. Again, all those story events will be coming back in his campaign as well. It's like Elder Goku's campaign and stuff like that. We brought back all those units. Um, so yeah, again, all those guys, they've been out for years and stuff like that. Again, typical little stuff. Um, yeah, Piccolo, it, um, Again, he's a he pickle fuse with now, so his um his, he came with a different game story event. He came with a completely different story event. Um his story event will back up as well. Again, all the story events are gonna come back up. Go on in the middle, um I think he could be a good plan in Mix Saga because Pickle's on there, but everybody else gotta run too. Cause it is what oh Goku the um EZA because they had two type of events units and the rest of them were kinda like, okay, let's just throw these guys in here, what type of disadvantage and blah blah blah. So yeah, Frieza, I think with Bark and Pickle are gonna do some good damage against them, but they're not gonna really link that one. Again, when this comes out, I'll go for all, like, all the units and stuff like that. This one's going to be a little bit more easier because they all are free to play more, like, you know, everybody's can probably get these guys done in, like, a day or two. Kaka and Goku's drop rate is kind of trash because his event comes from his trash, the War Circle event for that story event. Completely trash. Um, El Goku, I know a lot of people aren't going to have him done because, you know, for his EZA, you got to do kind of the same thing. You got to have, like, all these units ready to go and stuff like that. Rainbow, they all have to be rainbow in 100%. Again, you can just do whatever you want, try to bring them in, you know, bleh. It ought to be full. I think they just had to be awakened. They don't have to be 100%, but they just gotta be awakened though and fully EZA. Um, and stuff like that again. And Krillin's gonna get EZA as well. I might go for him and Bark in the same video because Krillin alone probably. Krillin and Bark. Unless they have their own separate EZA events, which I probably fuck. Because Krillin, I think, yeah, because he's gonna get EZA. It's weird. His, yeah, he fuck. Because he's from the Sand Saga, so again, Sand, Sand Saga stuff, that's gonna be good, really good for the game. Um, so yeah, pretty good stuff right here though. Some of these are gonna be pretty good though. Um, like I said, though, with Bardock specifically, though, he's going to be pretty good. Um, um, yeah, him and Piccolo is going to be really good. Again, him looking with Goku and Gohan can be really amazing. And I like Goku because I think they're going to have... Um, okay, guys, I'm going to probably bum rush through the rest of this video because, you know, I already talked about it. But yeah, like I said, you know, it's a pretty good time around. I like Goku might be a little bit harder because, you know, he's a new unit and stuff like that. Just guys in CA. Simple cool stuff, like I said before. But yeah, again, the rest of you should be pretty simple and easy to farm out. Again, I'll go for fully when it comes out. 
the full information and stuff like that, because other stuff I kind of want to do tonight as well. So yeah, um, for, um, of course, you know, events can be, um, have stamina and stuff like that, you know, right now, so you can go ahead and form up early if you haven't already, or if you're a new player, however you want to feel like it. Typical stuff. Um, then, of course, right here, um, this Brox EZA has been announced as well, so that will come out in the next couple of days. Um, of course, with Gresh right here, set on November 4th, um, you probably can tell it's in a couple more weeks. Um, El Prime Battle Frieza, his, um, Super Attack, Ultra Super Attack, will be getting, um, his animation to probably be effects, will be adjusted. You know, probably just like the link system update and stuff like that, or, you know, a project to revamp essay animation, however you want to pronounce it. Um, it's not sure what, um, it's complete, like, it's, a pre it's complete, like, revamp, like, Ella Gohan's Pickle Up, Ella Gohan's, and, um, Roger Vegeta's was. You know, last year, everybody was like, oh, yeah, Gohan's I mean, Super Attacks were lazy, boring, changed it. This year, everybody thought this could be the same thing, because of, um, you know, Super Saiyan 2, Angel Vegeta, Roger Vegeta. Everybody thought that as well. And then, like, okay, let's just revamp it anyway. Doesn't matter. So, yeah, again, it could be getting a revamp, could just adjust it, could link to stuff like that, but we don't know. Typical stuff. So, yeah. Um, we got one more thing right here. Of course, we got a new story event. It's Pan, and, um, Pan, Gohan, and then Full Moon Monster. Um, it should be a new story event. Of course, we are getting a new Grandpa Gohan and Pan, the first of this kind unit, which I really do love right here. Um, so they are coming in Hall Category Key 2. Everything's up 30%, so I guess they're going to be coming Hall Support. Again, we don't know too much about them, though. Um, they are kind of just going to come from the story event. Again, another unique, new, different, new unit. Of course, they are coming for Halloween. Found the Go Tank spot, the um, Great Salmon, you know, Trunk spot, and stuff like that, like they did the last couple of years. Really nice. I love it. It's unique and different. Completely love it. It's awesome. It's cool. I love it so much. Again, I hope we'll see more combo cards. More crazy combo cards like this. Again, it's like what ifs and stuff like that. I mean, like, Doki does a lot of good what ifs. Really good. Then we're here, I think it's just. Um, okay, I'm back though. Um, again, like I said, lots of cutouts. Sorry about that. This video is really just a mess. But yeah, like I said though, um, this pan and Gohan, again, unique, different unit. I love it so much. Uh, hopefully, they do more what ifs in the future. Again, they'll have their own wiki medals, own story events, so you can do a quick. They're talking about them from there. Again, um, just think of it as well. Um, can't think of it right now. Um, they're filling in, you know, Go Tank, um, like Ghost Go Tank's time slot. They're filling in, you know, Barbershop Go Tank, um, Oh, Chef Trunks put time slot. I think they could Doku Awaken, but no, no, they are Doku Awaken. I think Gun Tank's gonna have a Doku Awaken the next year he did, so yeah. Um, maybe we should, we'll, um, we should see all that soon in the game. It's just Isle of Palm Bravo, Krillin's Metal, stuff like that, so yeah. So I really want to go with today. Again, the other Freezer King, his EZA, I love it. Um, hopefully we'll do some more stuff like this in the future. Um, maybe they will do more LR specifically, though, like in Palm Bravo Vegeta. Takes out a little bit of a new one because it came out around this time last year for Christmas specifically, I do remember that. Um, I think it was from Gold Boy JP, I can't remember. It was either one, I can't remember. But yeah, gonna go ahead and end the video here. Like I said, I'm gonna spend that much time on it, so hopefully you did. Hopefully you edited, uh, edited up really nicely, though. So yeah, see you guys later, though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Oh, good job again, though. I forgot the issues. Fix it later, so hopefully you guys get a good, smooth recording experience. So yeah, see you guys later, though. Again, though, peace out.